Hey guys, John here with Survival Dispatch. And today I wanted to talk a little bit about a project that I've been working on for the last couple of months. I finally got it all together. And uh, I believe that a, a system like this is becoming more and more uh, relevant in today's society. What this is, is the Phalanx Defense System uh, Agent Discrete Body Armor Carrier. Um, it looks like just a typical, you know, normal bag two handles, you could carry it with you no matter where you go. But inside it's packed with a bunch of goodies that, that I've outfitted um, for what I think my needs would be. Um, you know, this is a system that you can buy either uh, just a bag or you can buy it with their DKX uh, body armor. And what I'll say is in this bag right here, I have level three, uh, so that's rifle uh, plate rated um, plates in this thing, front and rear. And um, the plates together, uh, they're made out of a product called Dyneema. Uh, it's extremely lightweight. Uh, these uh, two plates will actually float. They're actually buoyant. Um, and the bag itself with two plates weighs right about eight pounds. Now I've put a couple more products in here um, to outfit what I think I would need in case there was an active shooter situation or something like that. And um, so total weight on this bag right here is 12.5 pounds. Um, so it's still pretty lightweight. This bag has been in my truck with me for the last couple of months. Um, this is not an all-inclusive bag for me, like an active shooter bag or something like that. Um, I still carry a rifle bag in my truck as well. Um, and what this is, is that augments that bag. Um, the cool thing about this system, it's super quick and easy to throw on. And what I like about it is it really looks like any normal bag. You can like literally toss this, you know, in the front seat of your car and nobody would ever think, you know, that it was something tactical um, or, you know, try to guess what was inside. So, you know, just giving you, you know, a little look around here of the bag. Um, the back of it is just completely plain, nothing on it. The front of it has a nice YKK zippers all the way around. It has a nice little storage pocket. Um, I don't keep anything in there. I do not use this as like a daily bag. It's not my computer bag. It's nothing like that. This literally just sits in the back of my truck. Um, you know, if I go on trips, anything like that, it sits next to my rifle bag. Like I said, um, a lot of people are probably going to ask, uh, you know, hey, why is it coyote you trying to be tactical or anything like that? Not really. This bag comes in uh, this tan coyote color. It comes in black and it comes in red. Um, the reason why I didn't get the black bag is because my backpack is black. I have, you know, camera bags, things like that, that are black. If I ever had to uh, direct my wife to go grab a bag because I thought she needed it more than I did, I want to be able to tell her to go grab the tan bag. And this is pretty much the only tan bag that's in my truck. So it's the same with why all of my trauma kits are red because I can tell my wife or any other person around me, hey, go grab the red bag. They know what to grab. So that's the reason why I don't have a black bag. I'm not trying to be, you know, tactical or anything like that. Um, it's just what I chose. It does have some grommets here. If you wanted to put a shoulder strap, more than willing to. Um, but the cool thing about this bag is uh, you'll notice on the two handles here, one has a tab, like a, a indicator tab on it. Um, if you grab the other one, hold it up in front of you and then grab the zipper. It's a 360 degree zipper. So all you do is just pull it all the way around. And when it gets to this part, it's gonna break. If you do it, if you hold the correct handle, all you do is just swing it over, bring it up over your head. And now you have a chest rig. So it's got two straps that come around from the back here. Uh, and they buckle in with nice uh, Cobra buckles here. So, and I'm doing this slow just so you guys can see it. I'll do it fast here in just a little bit so you guys can see how fast this can deploy. So this is, this is my setup that I've come with. Uh, as you can see, 12 and a half pounds, two 30 round uh, P mags filled with 5.56, two uh, M&P9 Smith & Wesson, uh, 15 round mags fully loaded here, and a trauma kit. Got a rat's tourniquet on the outside. Um, this trauma kit isn't really what I'd use, normally use for a trauma kit, uh, but trying to keep the bag so it wasn't so ballooned out, um, I had to kind of break the contents down. But I have everything in here from chest seals to uh, you know gloves, chest seals, a quick claw, an extra tourniquet, um, everything that you you will need for like an active shooter situation is is all contained in in this trauma kit here. So this is the loadout. I tried to keep it as simple as possible. Um, 
you know, you have multiple different options. The whole bottom of this thing is Molly. The top portion here is Molly and uh, loop and loop, so you can put Velcro on it as well. Um, and you can configure this pretty much however you want to. Like I said, for me, this is not a, a standalone kit. You know, if this was a standalone kit, I might have a pistol thrown in here so that I'd have a weapon on me. Uh, but I carry a CCW every day, so this is just to augment my CCW. And like I said, I have my rifle bag that has my rifle in it, so this is to augment my rifle bag or my rifle. Um, so this is really just to a, a, another layer, not only of defensive protection with the body armor, uh, but also you know additional mags in case I were to need it. I can just grab this. I can grab my rifle, or if I just had this in my CCW, I know I have at least you know my spare mag plus two more mags if for any reason I needed four mags. I hope I never do. Um, so this is what it looks like on the back. You can see as well, it's got more molly if you want to attach some more. Um, but that's, you know, it's pretty simple. So I'll take it off real quick. And um, you, know, you can see it just lifts kind of up and over your head. And then you simply just fold it over, fold the tabs in, fold the shoulder straps in. And just so you guys know, the, uh, the mag carriers that I'm using are the Blue Force Gear uh, 10 speed pouches. And uh, it is a Blue Force Gear admin pouch also. Uh, I'm not paid by Blue Force Gear in any way. It's just that's what I felt like it happened to, to work out the best because they're, they're so trim. And then uh, you just simply just run the zipper around. And uh, your bag is, you know, transformed back into a regular, you know, everyday kind of looking computer bag. So I'll show you kind of how fast you can put this thing on. Let's see if we can go speed run here. So once again, uh, just hold it, hold the strap in your hand, take your opposite hand, and we're just gonna go all the way around. Oh, it got twisted. So, so there you go. In just a few seconds, you can have a plate carrier on for, for any defense situation. Um, I think these bags are fantastic. Uh, not saying you should, but I think every single teacher in America should have something like this sitting next to their desk. If you work in an office complex where you're not able to carry a firearm, a black one of these could sit next to your desk and nobody would ever take a second look at it. So, you know, if you work in a place where you just cannot, you know, buy your company's rulings and that you want to follow, can't carry a firearm, defense is a great way to go. So take the mags off of this thing, maybe put a little bit more medical on it, but you got, you know, rifle plated uh, body armor that can help you in case the situation were to happen. Um, I think this is a fantastic system. I love the weight. I love the fact that it only weighs, you know, 12 pounds and I have extra mags and trauma kit with me. If you guys want more information on this, make sure you check out Phalanx Defense Systems website. And uh, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you got any more comments on, you know, what I'm running or suggestions, feel free to leave them below. And I hope you enjoyed this uh, review of the Phalanx Defense uh, Agency Discrete Body Armor Carrier System. And until next time, be safe. Thank you.